Hello and welcome back to Gallant Griffin. And here we are with a new series. Here we are with Delta Rune Chapter 2. Now, if you remember, I played Chapter 1 a long time ago, like three years, two years, I don't know. It's just been a bit. And that was when I went by Axel LFN. So, like, kind of makes me feel old in some ways. So, so, but I figured I'm, I'd play this right on launch, and it is. September the 17th. It's actually my dad's birthday, fun fact. <laughs> Had some wonderful um, spicy food, so it was cool, cool. Um, but I'm ready to get right into this. Um, I'm gonna first answer no. The beginning. Seven chapters? Toby Fox, you ambitious little guy. <laughs> Please, I don't know if he's little. Wait, let me... <laughs> Toby Fox height. I'm obsessed with celebrity heights. How tall is Toby Fox? Um, uh, he's dog sized. I don't know. I mean, I guess if he goes by the avatar of the dog, then I guess it counts. Um, but anyways, before like we jump in, I just want to say how excited I've honestly been for this game. Like, I followed a bit of development on Twitter. I don't. I'm not too active on Twitter. Don't follow me. I don't even have a really good Twitter. I don't think I don't post at all. But I've been hyped. I've been looking at the progress here and then, and it's just been very just like kind of quiet. Like, which is usually how Toby keeps it, which is great. And going into this, I just know it's going to be great storytelling, awesome comedy, and I know the music is going to be phenomenal. So like, let's just get into it. <laughs> Play. Do not. Wonder what happens if I click do not. Oh yeah, I don't even get to name myself. It's not Halloween. You don't get to do the spookiness. Also, I have a light right there, which is really cool. Music so far. I like it. Oh, it's coming in with the don't forget melody. Ooh, I hear some nice bongos or something of the sort. Alright, enter your own name. Oh, frick. <laughs> My microphone is, like, covering up the keys, so that could be a problem later on. Well, last time I probably went by, um, Axel, but this time I'm going with Griffin. Since that is, in fact, my actual name, it is not Axel, and it is not anything else, it's Griffin. This is your name. <laughs> Oh, I have to do voices. Oh, I forgot. Chris? Chris, honey, are you awake? Wait! Is that a... A knife? Oh, is this picking up right from last time? No! Oh. Chris, did you eat all of the pie? <laughs> It is your knife in this empty tin, is it not? Oh, Chris. Am I going to have to lock the oven again? Well, hurry out of bed. It's time for school. Yeah, because last time we got left off on a cliffhanger. Freaking. What even was the chapter? It was like Cyber Soul, was it? I don't know. Can I read? It's a birdcage. When the door's closed, there's no escape. That's interesting. Closed door. And this is as real stuff, right? It's five dollars in your brother's drawer. Take it. <laughs> I mean, my choices don't matter. <sighs> uh, could this come into? I mean, is he even home? Would he mind? I'll I'll pay him back eventually. Let's take it for now. You reluctantly borrowed five dollars. Uh, I'm gonna get the bad ending, but I can't. I can't anyways. I know it. On the computer's desktop is a folder called Epic Game Stuff. It's a poorly drawn design for a game. Seems the last boss is a creature with giant rainbow wings. Undertale? Doesn't seem like this game ever saw the light of day. Oh, interesting. Is this the canon where as real as Toby Fox? It's what they call you. <laughs> the door is locked. Is that the bathroom or- oh wait, no, that's Toriel's room. Ah uh, yes, the water sausage. The cactus. There's not much to say about it. 
There's no time to read books, just generally. <laughs> what are you talking about? There's always time to read books. You're on some drugs, Chris. I don't know what to say. Um, hey, let's see. The shower ledge, there's a small container of apple scented shampoo. This is different, I think. A gallon size. Oh, never mind. Never mind. It's the same. Okay. It's not yet time to wash your hands. I mean, it might be. Okay. It's toilet. Flush it. Can I get the secret ending? I mean, it's not. It's just an Easter egg, for goodness sake, but. Twice. Okay. A what? No, does Toriel not come up anymore? That's so boring. Where is she? Is she out here? Maybe she, oh, maybe she's already at the car or whatever. The Mercedes GLA or something. Honda, Toyota, whatever. It's trash can. Somehow it's, oh yeah. This is all normal. Gingerbread monsters and gingerbread humans. That's cute. I just, I just missed this, so I'm just reading over all the dialogue. There's a photo on the fridge. It's a view. I should have played the first chapter, or at least watched my playthrough before coming back to this, honestly. Your mother and your brother. I might do it at some point, but I think, I just want to go in with what knowledge I had before. It's a landline phone, but you already have a cell phone. Ah, uh, yes. It's a chariot, the beloved living room chair. Everyone loves it. All right, let's, there we go. Doors are weird. Well, shall we go? Also, forgive me if my voices aren't exactly the same. I think I can do Lancer. Oh, is Lancer not here this time? Uh, I'll try my best. <laughs> Chris, th there you are. I even Susie showed up before you. <laughs> Hey, Chris! Oh, I don't even know the voice, but... If I knew you were gonna be late... I wouldn't have shown up on time. Susie, please don't kick your desk. Treat school property like you treat people. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Next time I'll aim for the vitals. Thought she was just gonna be like, Next time I'll aim for the head! Crazy psycho killer laugh. Th th that, that's not what I. I in any case, good morning, class. Let me also see if, yes, my volume is loud enough. The game isn't overpowering me currently. <laughs> I'm still speaking Alfie's voice. We have a lot to go over today. First, we're starting the reading from page 142. Any, any volunteers? Oh, I don't know how to do Noel's voice. Um, I... I guess I could read the... Uh, trouble yourself, not Noel. I will validly take this blow of humiliation. <laughs> okay, I at least got some idea of it. Uh, um, th that's okay, I can... Ahem. Page 142. It was the best of times, it was the worst of times. Times are pretty good, times are pretty bad. Mediocre times, iffy times, so-so times. Listening to this, your eyes began to close automatically. <laughs> yep. Have a nice day, everyone. A and please, remember your group projects. Oh, um, Chris, are you okay? You were, um, so sleeping on class. D don't worry, I'm not mad, just, just concerned. Usually only sleep through the start. <laughs> Good luck and rest well tonight, okay? Oh, that's so caring. See, I love teachers like this. Like, I mean, I feel like Alfie should take a little more directive. Like, not like yell at you, but like, just kind of like come up to you, like in the middle of class, just like, not really just like tell you off for it, but just like engage in conversation. Cause I found that like, that's when my teachers go up and do that to me, that's really supportive for me. Cause sometimes like, I just kind of start to like, what's the word, dole off or something. Well, who look who it is, the school zombie. I'm gonna have to try and make her voice not so bad so it doesn't hurt my voice. You were sleeping like a corpse all class. <laughs> What's the matter? Had trouble going Betty by last night? <laughs> Me too, Chris! <laughs> like I could sleep after yesterday. Oh, we're picking up literally, okay. Just waiting for today felt like years! Did all that stuff really happen? Lancer, Ralsei, everyone, are they still- Look. 
You've been wondering the same thing, right? Come on already! Her voice is basically undying. <laughs> Here we go, back again. It's interesting to see uh, that whole that that all her sprites are like um different from the first game. All right, Chris, this is it. Moment of truth. Everything we've been waiting for is just behind this. If we uh open this and there's nothing inside, well uh we still be. Screw it. Let's just open it already. Uh um, S Susie. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> this is a cute theme. Noel, hey, what the hell are you doing here? Uh, um, sorry to bother you, but um, I, well, I just, Birdly and I were going to the library to do some research for our group projects, and if it's okay, um, would you want to come too? Oh, Chris, you can come too. I mean, <laughs> I'm trying to give Noel kind of like a. Like, not almost like, um, like the typical feminine, just, oh, hello! But, like, I feel like she's just a little, just, like, not too arf, <laughs> not too arf, not too off from my voice, kind of. Just kind of, like, a little more feminine, a little more, like, jumpy. Not, ju not jumpy, um, I guess in some ways social. Uh, I mean, we're, like, uh, busy with the... Chris, help me out here, what do we say? Hanging out and... Alone in the closet. Crime. <laughs> I'm going chaotic neutral. Well, this would also be the chaotic. Either way, anything Chris does is just chaotic neutral. Because if I go with this, no, I'll just be like, oh, I don't have a chance with her. Because I'm pretty sure, I can't remember, but I'm pretty sure, like, I don't know Susie's sexuality. I'm pretty sure she's, like, either lesbian. I think she's lesbian. Um, I think, I can't, I don't know. Either way, both of these chicks like girls, so like, that's what that's what I remember, at least from reading up on stuff. Um, but crime, I mean, I guess that would kind of add to like, Susie being like, oh, I'm the bad girl. So let's go with the crime option. You know, just committing crimes. Just gonna do some crimes and go to jail. Forever. <laughs> it sucks. Uh, oh, uh, um, well, uh, that sounds, um, just, have fun you two. I'll, um, be at the library. Chris, if you could bring her by later. It would mean a lot to me. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> Wait, Chris, what the hell was that? Why would Noel ask me? To do homework? With her? Death witch? Death witch? Death witch? Wish much? Does she want to fail? Wait a second. Wait a second. Chris, did you notice how nervous she was? And like, blushing and stuff? Chris, you don't think she... Uh, she's onto her secret identities? <laughs> you know, this dark world stuff. Let me move the game up so that way I'm more closer to looking at my webcam. Damn, we gotta keep this under wraps, Chris. I didn't know Susie was becoming the oblivious, um, arrogant, angry person. <laughs> this is our thing, you know? Anyway, unless she's just pretending to be oblivious, which I could be possible. Anyway, enough waiting already, right? Let's go. I don't think it's gonna work. Oh, I spoke too soon. Playing some D&D. &D. I don't know, is that the canon for this? I've heard that before. Oh, can I move? Oh, oh wow, okay, you just- <laughs> I thought she was gonna like tackle me. Hey, Chris, uh, you really gonna walk everywhere so slowly? I know you're kinda- uh, take it in, but you can run, you know? You remembered something about the X button. <laughs> Oops. Oh no, it's been a while, shut up game. Yeah, the darkner area. Here we are. Rose! Chris, Susie. It's been ever so long. Y yeah, yeah. It's been what, a day? Oh, that is short, isn't it? It's just that I've never had friends before, so I've never waited so long to see them again either. Fine, guess we'll try not to let you die of loneliness. I bet Lancer wants to see us too, right? 
Oh, is this where it's just like, nope, no Lancer this time. Hey, wait a sec. Where is Lancer? Please let me- I want to do his voice. His voice is the best. Sylvie! <laughs> Where's everybody? Worry not, Susie. You'll see them in a moment. Just wait here, alright? Okay. Hey, this better not be some kind of prank or something. Chris, I have something to ask you. I need you to return to the light world and go to the old classroom, to the east of the closet doors. Inside, gather everything on the ground and bring it back here, could you? This is gonna be chaotic, isn't it? Oh, this is cool, so we can like travel between the two worlds. You gathered all the junk off the floor and turned it into a giant dusty ball. Yeah, I feel like I should have read up because I can't remember Ralsei's voice. I'm just kind of going with it. It's fine. <laughs> just carry it on my head. Oh, and it just dissolves. Hey, Chris, so where is every... Oh. One. Oh. <laughs> Let's go! Get through the back, Clove! Lancer? Hey, Chris, don't know what you did, but hell yeah. Oh, it's rules card! Nice. Um, okay, what was it? It was just Sylvie. Yeah, it was like that. Everyone's here! But, uh, what happened to, uh, Lancer's castle? All gone. Gone? Let me see how much- okay, yeah, we're doing good on time. <laughs> I don't care if anyone judges my dancing. Right, when Chris sealed the fountain, that dark world disappeared and turned back into a normal classroom. So where's Lancer gonna live now? Don't worry, Susie. We'll conquer Ralsei's castle as our own. <laughs> Chris, as you bring dark world denizens back here, the power of our fountain will transform this town more and more. From now on, the enemies we spare will be recruited to our town, so let's keep sparing enemies, okay? Anyhow, why don't we all have a look around? We can head north towards the castle. I have a special surprise to show you there. <laughs> Not if I surprise myself first! Last one there is a fresh and fragrant egg. <laughs> Come on, Chris, you gonna let him beat us? Ooh, nice music. Oh, thou hast transplanted this us to thine castle town, and truly a mag magnificent town of castles it off. But who, oh, mm, something aunt lacking if it feeleth, couldst thou guys perhaps bring in an evil ruler or something? Yeah, maybe. I don't know. Can we go to the bakery? Kind of in the way, bud. Okay. Oh. Ho oh, oh, ho, I am Chef Lancer. Try my delicious hand formed cookies. They are free for a price. What's the price? Zero dollars. Take cookie. I now pronounce you Cookie and Wife. Lancer Cookie was out to your items. Can you see that? See. Lancer Heals one HP. Alright, what else do we got? Equip power. Ooh, do we have like special abilities? Dark Prince, Dark Knight. Oh, she's Batman now. Has friends now. <laughs> Configure. Can I make this full? Oh, I can make this full screen. Alright, everyone prepare. Ah! Okay. Let me adjust the game. Hold on. Okay, so my webcam will take up a bit of space, but hopefully not too much, so. <laughs> Dang. Auto run? Mm, I don't need that. What if I need to sneak around? Actually, can I make... Yeah, I'm making these WASD. Oh yeah, I <laughs> kind of have to...
There we go, that's better. Cause then, cause I have literally the area keys right under my mic, and that is very chaotic to have to deal with, so. Wait, so let me just, okay, let me, and then A and D, yep, okay. Yes, it works. Oh, I can, I can shift. Okay, I didn't know about that. Uh, that's probably better. Um, let's read around. Mom Amoeba, welcome to Top Vape Bakery. <laughs> Our special chefs spin baked goods at the top of their class. Also, if you notice, since I have a new design on the channel, I am wearing flannels, or I'm, I'm, I'm gonna at least try to more frequently. Oh. <laughs> I just, I literally said, hey, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna not put the arrow keys in it. Oh my goodness, can I? And then I literally didn't, I tried for the arrow keys again, wait. Seems like Hathi likes this place. She hopes you'll like it too. Aww. Thank you, Hathi. Party Dojo? This sounds fun. Oh, it's this guy. Hey boss, boss. Yeah, I'm so glad to have a nice boss. I could shed a tear. But I won't. I'm on the job. I'll cry at home with the kids. Boss, you're strong, but there's always time to learn. The next step after tutorials is training. So, me and the boys, <laughs> me and the boys, let's go. Got you together a dojo. Complete our battle challenges and get some fabulous prizes. Meanwhile, you might get a little bit tougher. We're gonna make you the strongest boss. Challenge, let's go. Our first fight? Oh. Learn how to, learn how to spare like a champ. Um, my hat is actually getting kind of warm. Um, Oh, club sandwich. Um, I can get Joe's life savings. All right, let's do it. Boss, you can act and spare on the same turn. If you know Chris's act will give an enemy 100% mercy, spare them on the same turn with Susie or Rolse. Jo Jigsaw Joe jigs in. Shave? Oh, this is interesting. Okay, I have to have both keys here. And then defend. <laughs> he just wraps himself. Shovel, stubble. Oh! Oh, boss, you spam me? Nice. Oh. Wait a second, I got something else to remind you of. Boss, it works the same way with making an enemy tired. If an act will make an enemy tired, use well say his pacify right away. I'm just gonna... Okay, so I guess it's, yeah, magic. Pacify. It's pacify, but the enemy wasn't tired. What? You're putting me to sleep. I mean, you want. Make me tired and pass. Oh, I have to... Sleepy story. <laughs> Alright, that works. <laughs> Susie told the enemy us a bedtime story about beating them up. <laughs> Cast pacify. You get boss. You can manage to spam enemies right away. Battles will go a lot faster. That's all. Amazing battle. As promised, here's your reward. You receive Joe's life saving. One dollar, no Joe. <laughs> can I give it back to you? I feel bad. Claimed. I have claimed his life savings. All right. Get 100% TP without getting. Oh yeah, I know. Okay, I know about TP a little bit. Please. <laughs> Oh, well, I failed. <laughs> well, it's rain bright. You try moving one direction. Yeah, it was just hard because I just got stuck into a corner. Alright, Grace challenge. Alright. Grace! Ah, no! Come on, I'm determined. I think this first episode will be a bit longer just because I want to try all these things first. I might make this the last thing I... One like last things I like explore probably. Oof! Come on, where am I at? Oh, this is so okay. Never mind. That I'm gonna try that for another day. Okay, who are you? Hey, hey, hey! Looks like fighting wasn't the cause for us. Lucky for you. Just hope you don't meet my friends. Oh yeah, I remember this guy. Whoa! Our house is a dojo. Makes me want to fight. Can't we go to sleep? Oh yeah, the box guy here. 
Finally, a dojo for people that are normal shaped. <laughs> I'll train myself for the tournament. Hey, you do you, bud. You got this. I'm Battles Master. Ask me about battles. Um, I'm pretty good. Wait, what's hole mean? We failed to hit our funding goal. I'll not talk about our hole. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna leave. Um, I don't need to see the guards. Let's see his shop. Is it? Yeah, it's Sean. Sean, that's his name. I got one dollar. A dark burger. I might have to save up for that. Spooky sword. Sell. <laughs> what can I sell? Wait, how much is the like of the laser cookies? Five dollars. Yeah, I don't do it. You don't have anything. Can I talk? Oh wait, what was my voice that I gave him? Um, hmm. So we are now in the castle town. Well now, makes no difference to me. As long as I stay in my shop, these walls won't change. But, in a way, I suppose it's just a little bit amusing to see you again. I'm sure you three will have an interesting journey. Me, I'll just be here offering the same old junk. As you find stronger treasure, I'm sure you'll have re little reason to return here. But if you have some time, I'll offer you a biscuit and a hint. Thank you. I miss this guy. See you again, or not. <laughs> okay, cafe. This is the last place, I think. Oh, it's the thing from earlier. Oh, we're still doing Gone Time anyways. I think we can hit 45. Let me need, please. Oh. What do you have to say? Mamma me, but I wanted to run the bakery, but someone is already working there. A cafe that serves pastries, what a disgrace. So a humiliating thing, what happened next? I don't know, Starbucks. Check recruits. Oh, is this a side quest? <laughs> oh, these are a little like things from chap yeah, chapter one. Interesting. Okay. Ooh, what do we have here? It's a manual. Read the topic. Recruits. If you spare pass by enough, they may they will be recruited. Recruits will appear in your town. <gasps> That's so cool! Cause I I mean, even though like the ending doesn't change, I like to have like all of the like the th little stuffs. <laughs> Item storage. You will now have access to a storage menu at save points. Ooh. Oh, okay. That's that's useful. Transformed from the power of friendship. You are filled with the power of friendship-based architecture. <laughs> Alright. Um, wait. Why are there three save slots, though? What? Wait, let me re Oh, okay. There- oh, okay, I see what it's saying now. Let's see. Wait, what have we here? It's a bit scary moving to a new place, but as a ball. There's nothing to sphere except sphere itself. Ha. <laughs> ah, very funny. Prince, Prince Rarstag, I will keep your heart to work until you need it. He's so cute, he just has little hands just behind his back. He's like, eh, no, I'm a little happy guy. Just wanted to show off your huge house, huh? No, what I want to show you is upstairs. Yeah, I kind of give him a voice that I would probably give, like, as real quarters for bad guys. Nice. Wait, okay, who, what's here? Door's locked. Is that an elevator? Seven quarters. <laughs> well, obviously, we're going to the bad guys one. Oh. Oh, there's the Chaos King. <laughs> this checker. It's violently protecting the jail. Can we get it to transform or no? We're still behind bars for some reason, but it's okay. We've grown to love this hellish place where we dress as animals. <laughs> That's a conspiracy theory. Maybe all the animals at the zoo are secretly humans. <laughs> You've heard of animals dressed as humans. What about humans dressed as animals? We decided to dress as kings. It's culture to exchange. Okay. Oh. Oh. Oh, he's in a hamster cage. Ugh, the lighteners. 
Have you come to humiliate me? No. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Do I feel like being a douche? <laughs> nah. Mr. King, the Lightners returned everyone here safely. If you're willing to reconsider, then. What? Live in a kingdom ruled by you? A Lightner's little patsy? Staying in a cell is far less humiliating. Now, if you'll excuse me, my giant hamster wheel is getting cold. Alright. You do you, bud. By the way, is my son happy? Like you care! You're gonna throw him off a cliff! Uh, your prejudice made my bluff too effective, I see. Besides, even if I threw him, he would just... Bounce. My son is... A bouncy little pumpkin. Ah, oh, cute! We're done talking to you! I love Susie. Susie is just the realistic one. Just like, no, we ain't putting up with any toxic BS. I'm here for it. Although I do love Ralsei's, like, optimism. <laughs> uh, I have a surprise for you two. I made rooms for you in the castle. Rooms? So you can stay here whenever you want. Um, I'd be happy if this place could be, like, a second home to you. A place that you can go. No matter what's happening outside. Uh, well, we'll take a look. Oh, there's... <laughs> cool, oh my goodness. Oh, but where's your room? Is it the center thing? Oh, this is a little embarrassing, guys. I don't, I don't know how you feel about being in my room. It's stand for your manual. I thought you might want to keep it here in case you want to read it. Wardrobe full of all sorts of different clothes. You wear wherever you want. Oh? I mean, normally I'd be like, ah, oh, more than a striped shirt, but like we're wearing like full on decked out armor here, so. Alright, let's see what we got. And Susie, this is your room. Um, I try to make it something you'd like, but you can put anything else you want here too. I really hope you like it. Mm. My own room, huh? Hey. Yes, that's pretty cool. My own room, like this. How long did it uh, take you to do this? Well, uh, since I last saw you two, I... <laughs> Man, you're a real weenie, you know that? <laughs> I think she likes it, Chris. <laughs> Jealous I got the cool room? Look, Chris. That's so wholesome. Because, like... You, everyone and their mom probably has, like, been able to, like, read into, into between the lines with this. But, like, Susie probably hasn't had, <laughs> probably, I say probably. Susie hasn't had the best upbringing in, like, wherever she lives probably isn't, you know. Susie, you didn't get to read the manual, so I put it over here for you. Cool, I'll read it before bed. They'll put me to sleep. <laughs> I mean, hey, if you, if you want to read, if you want to read. Oh, I freaking went into a wall. Damn, there's everything in here. Pine cones, chalk, moss, jars of salsa, pieces of ice. Yo, <laughs> she had ice cruncher. Black crumbs for the toaster, jawbreakers. Oh, and like actual food too. That's... Aww. Oh. <laughs> I was not expecting that, I will have to say. Lancer, you aren't gonna believe how sick my room is. A room as thick as you? Whoa, I wanna see. I'll keep digging holes until I reach your room. Uh, it's got a door, you know. A door? Wow, Peach Boy, you went all out. <laughs> Let's see what we got here. Wow, it's better than I remembered. I even have my own bed now. Now I don't have to sleep in the hole anymore. I thought you already had a bed. No, that was for the bike. Wait, is this... Can I make all the tongues stick out? What if I speak to you now? I love how my floor is full of holes. <laughs> That's so weird, does it? Do we just emerge from it? Hey, Ralse, What's up here? Oh, just more rooms. I'm renovating. So, is your room up here? 
Uh, yes, I still am, haven't dusted it though. Yeah, look, we need to see your nerdy glasses collection anyway. <laughs> so, what do we do now? Feel free to explore town until you're ready to leave. Huh, <laughs> like we're gonna leave now, right, Chris? I mean, I don't know what we're gonna do. Door is still locked. Oh, I nearly forgot, this is where I cook. Cook everything in a giant witch's pot. Of course, cauldron, cauldron cooking is very convenient. Here, Chris, Susie, have a cake. <laughs> a little thick on the frosting. Th th that was for sharing. Hey, anyone who's free to make an interception. I mean, <laughs> not everyone has your giant monster crocodile jaws, Susie. There's an alligator. That's the biggest debate I feel like we need to address. Um, but, no, actually we have a bit more time. Let's actually get to some plot, I feel like. This is so cool. I love all the music and everything. Okay. Oh, we have you. Well, it's quite a wonderful town, really. Thank you. So why am I alone here? A bit of self-reflection, I suppose. I do you realize I was quite a coward before? So I want to say, well, I still am my cards. I cannot handle society. Now I'll be living at the top of this cliff. When I'm ready to meet society again, I will be back. Thank you. Thank you for the wonderful home. I will not use it. <laughs> All right, what was the point of that? There's a hole in the wall. There's nothing inside. Yay, pointless stuff. Okay, wait. Yeah, cause like, what is there? Oh. Mr. Society left, didn't he? Hmm. I reckon I knew this wouldn't happen. It's not no fault of yours. Well, he'll, um, he'll um, be back one day. I don't know what kind of accent that I was supposed to give him. Oh, trees. I must gain nutrients by eating clothes. Such is the way of the worm. <laughs> I dig it. Looks like the old looks like the clothes are nibbled. Take a bite. Yes. Put your mouth against the mannequin's cheek. Oh, <laughs> kinky. C C Chris, don't bother. It tastes awful. And Susie. Oh, I like being like this. Don't tell anybody. Hey, I'm not one to judge. Seems to be locked. It may never open again. Oh, well, that's sad. I liked it out there. Because you had, like, the quiet autumn and stuff. Are we ever going to get to use the thrash machine? Um, do we go now? Because, like, I've talked to everyone. Well, I mean, not everyone. Like, there's, like, that guy, but I'm going to leave him alone. Like, I've talked to my favorites pretty much, so I'm good. Wait, Chris, we're leaving? But we just got here. Man, I don't want to go do our group project. Oh, you two have homework? Oh, uh, well. Susie, Chris, you ought to do it right away. School's important. I banish you from this kingdom until you start your project. Oh, fine, I'll do it. Jeez. Susie, don't worry, I'll go and help you too. Er, wait, Lancer, perhaps you shouldn't. Too late, kind boy. Friendship for me. Oh. Lancer was added to your key items. What? Where'd you go? Don't worry, I just entered your inventory. I'll just be hanging out in Chris's pocket. Don't know what that means, but okay. Fairy not! I too shall assist if. Uh, we're good. Aha, uh -huh, quite! We as a team aren't good. Oh. <laughs> okay. Rules became a key item even though no one wanted that. All right, enough already. Let's get going. No, 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 no. Don't make me leave. Don't make me leave. I want to sell him in the shop. Good luck today, Chris. See you soon. No! Because I, I feel like they know that we would try that. I mean, it's a key item, but it would have been funny for the bit. Oh, damn, guess we got to do our project. Guess we got Lancer, right? 
Lancer, where are you? Damn, guess he skipped out after all, huh? Hmm, so, where should we do this? What? The library? Ah, uh, well, alright. Oop. Oh, do I... Can I check? Do I have an... Oh, yeah, I do have an... No! Wait. Ball of junk. A small ball. Okay. But where is the answer? Cards, the jack of spades, and the rules card. Oh, that's so clever. All right. But we are going to have to end off this first good episode of Deltarune Chapter 2. Um, if you enjoyed it, please spam the thumbs up with your thumbs up and subscribe for more whenever it comes out content. I guess I'm kind of recycling like my old outro or something, whatever. Um, and uh, be prepared because I'm going to be uploading this like whenever I get the chance pretty much just because, well, I'm going to be recording this whenever I get the chance because I don't want to get spoiled on anything because like this game is going to be like amazing. I know it like even just the second chapter, like. I'm just already so blown away by just the, the quality and like the whole effort from Toby Fox and his team. So, uh, I'll see you guys later. Bio? Is that what I say anymore? I don't know. <laughs>